What's up, sac passe y que tal, mis amigos? It's your boy J Mo back again with another video. And today, today is a good day because we are gonna play Red Dead Redemption 2. multiple reasons it's a little bit bittersweet because i know my baby brother jr wanted to play this game since red dead one came out he was already talking about, i can't wait to the next one i can't wait to the next one and um now he's in boston so he's i hope this video is enough for you bro because <laughs> you know for the past couple of hours the game has been loading and it is completely ready now and by the time you're watching this it'll be available to the public to go purchase but of course you know i went and got an early copy so that way i can make this video for you guys and kind of give you an insight in case you didn't know if you wanted to get the game or not now some things you may want to know before you buy the game it comes with two discs okay two discs and the reason it comes with two discs is because the game is huge now that's good news and bad news the good news is you're gonna get a lot of gameplay for your buck the bad news is there are people that are going to be in loading um, purgatory for a while you know what I'm saying um, that's another thing a lot of people ask if you could get the physical disc or a digital download now that's completely up to you the way you like to play your games but i like going for the disc you know um it took like i said maybe an hour and a half two hours to load the whole game up i know some people that are going to be stuck in that loading purgatory shout out to mr adonis who uh pre-ordered the game and sent me a timer showing me how much longer he has left on his digital download but yeah again that is a personal preference type of thing so if you like all your games to be digital downloads then go ahead and do that but we are about to start the game I am super excited right now um, yeah let's dive right in Red Dead Redemption 2 it looks so cinematic speaking of cinematics I always wonder if you guys like to see the cutscenes when you're watching the first looks you know of games um, or if you prefer to watch it yourself once you get the game. I'm not always sure, so I like to speed through them, but at the same time, some of you may get on to watch the whole story. So that being said, a friend of mine, Adonis once again, who's still waiting for his game to load right now as we speak, <laughs> he advised that I go ahead and give you guys a spoiler warning if you are not wanting to watch the cutscenes, then you know, um, you'll be able to fast forward pretty much and see you know whatever you do want to see but for this particular first look gameplay I'm going to go ahead and let the cutscenes play all right so let's go it's probably of those like holographic cards that people used to collect like the Pokemon cards Another thing, I do hope that um, we don't get that, like, a lot of loading in between towns and cities and stuff. Because after that long of a download that they made us sit through, please tell me that's compensating for something. And it's not like, you leave this town, loading. You start going to this town, loading. Cutscene, loading. Because that will probably kill the mood of the game for me, personally. See that revolver? That's the revolver spinning the little. <laughs> I'm so excited right now. I feel like a little kid. By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. America was becoming a land of laws. Still roamed, but 
they were being hunted down and destroyed. Rockstar. I was going to wear a Rockstar shirt. But I didn't have time to get everything together. I was running a lot of errands. I still got my own business that I'm running. My fiance has her own business that she's running. Sometimes she needs help from me for doing some stuff. So I didn't have time to like get all dressed. But at least I got a, a Red Dead box back here. Um, you know, I got like a box kit that they gave me when I went. Because they knew I was going to do this. So yeah. I didn't get time to get a poster either, which I was going to put behind the door. That's why the door is open right now. But this is always starting to so shut right now. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah. This kind of reminds me of the beginning of um, the Tarantino movie, the, the Hateful Eight or Six. The Eight. That movie was good, so hopefully this one is good. I love games that feels like we're watching a movie, but I'm just in control. Chapter one, Colter. Bring him in here. Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny. Sean, Mac, they may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it. Gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody? We're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, Get yourselves warm. Stay strong. I think I'm that little boy. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. 
Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. We need you strong. Okay. Look at the checks in his hand. I Come said, on, yeah. let's go. Y'all yeah, know what I meant. Ain't no. sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Coming up. Take it easy. I guess one at a time. Bridge. What is it? Even if it was to break, it's a small break. I don't like Hey, move up alongside me. Can't see you back there. Can't believe we lost Davy, too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. That's a start. Easy. Hey. I think I see something up the path. You up ahead! Who's there? I thought somebody was cocking their revolver. Gentlemen. Who's there? Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. The place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Er, <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Okay. Let's head down there. Up here. 
the game just be like, surprise, you're dying. Spots. Let me do the talk. We don't want to scare these folks. Someone's having fun in there. You too. Get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. Take cover in that shed over there. What are you doing? Get inside the shed. I'm trying to get inside the shed. Arthur, what are you doing? I said get out of sight. I guess it's not this shed. Or maybe I mean that right there. Get in position. Come on. Can I hop over stuff? Not there. Over in the cattle shed. Okay. I do not know how to run. Or maybe it's because the snow is too. disturb you uh my friends and i well we got into some trouble up the way lost in the storm ah uh, gentlemen we can't help you mister i got folks arthur dying on the trail. arthur we got a problem <laughs> folks there's a corpse right here no i i just arthur some there's a body in the wagon i hear you just gentlemen Keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, but... Uh, I guess it's just this guy. Place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Oh, I'm starving. 
You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Alright guys, so I can eat some biscuits. Nah, my throat gonna be dry. Um, so canned peaches. I like peaches. Or baked beans. I'm be farting on the whole way. But it looks like the beans do the most. You know what I'm saying? Why you all these? these? Oh, Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. I saw it. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Mike have found a dead body in the wagon outside. The place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Meet me out here when you're done. I'm sure if there's jewelry and there's gold and stuff, that means there's gonna be a shop, store, or something where I can sell this stuff. And if they don't have a carry limit, you know your boy about to have his pockets filled. Hmm. Poor bastard was married too. So they just killed this dude, took his place, saved us the trouble. <laughs> Jake and Sadie wedding September. That sucks. Okay, I read that. What else you got? Here we go upstairs. I know you guys don't want to see me sit here and search for everything, but it's like the time I came out here, we need everything. But I want to be boring. Just give me a minute. Yeah, so he would have made me miss out on these bullets and oat cakes. I wonder if I take, like, how much fall damage if I jump off this? We're not about to find out. Alright, let's check the bed real quick, see if there's anything in here. In this chest. Somebody's coin purse? You know they got some coins. 91 cent. Oh, I forgot this is the old old times. I'm like, bruh, 91 cents. Okay, let's go. Alright, check there. Alright, let's stop being done. Let's go, 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 go. I guess you can't run indoors. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, keep looking for go stuff. see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin. See what we missed. Sure. I don't like the fact that he told me to hurry up, but then told me to keep looking for stuff. Oh, this the <laughs> That's where they take a dump. The barn's over there. Yo, Are you going to check there. that barn? I'm going, I'm going.
probably some people in here, huh? So should I hit him first or ask a question? To go ahead. Where is we need to find out what's going on. Uh, with the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. See, I gotta oh. think in the mindset of I don't you know, know anything else. These guys. Please. Let me pause it for a second. Because sometimes when you're playing these games, it's kinda like, do I act like how I would act? And that's how I usually play most of my games. But in this game, I'm in a game. I got to think like I'm these guys. So I'm thinking if we let him go, he going to go tell some other people and some other people going to come get us. So he's he's dead. Please spare me. I promise you, you won't see me again. You're right. I won't see you again. Oh, the, the controller vibrated while I was... Um... There's no witnesses. Can I move his body? Where'd my gun go? Oh, that's why I can't shoot him. Beach on my hand. this the type of game that like each decision you make is like crucial line if I ever heard one I should have said that to my fiance like listen I ain't no good dude 
but I ain't dumb bad dudes that you've been messing with. You feel me? <laughs> We're bad men, but we ain't dumb. Adler. 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 Sadie Adler. Okay, there we go, Sadie. Mrs. I. He. He was my husband. So I'm just going to stop it right there for now. Um, I will say that this game has hella potential. I am going to keep playing it and I guess um, I might post another video about it later on, but I just wanted to do a first look gameplay video of uh, this particular game because, you know, it's a lot of hype about it. Some people don't know, they're on the edge and hopefully this can help you make a decision. Um, my initial reaction would be that um it just shows what potential it has more so than jumps right at you in the beginning but the fact that this is like 105 gigs loaded up on the ps4 i can imagine that um you know they pacing themselves because there's a lot of things that i'm like still not like happy about just yet but i don't know if it's because i'm in the very beginning or if it's because that's just how the game is so i'm definitely gonna have to do a follow-up video to this video but for right now i just want you to see the way the graphics look see the way the characters are how they interact with each other and i do like you can just you know step up to anybody and pretty much it looks like anybody who's an npc you can step up to them hit that l2 button and talk to them have a conversation you could go to your horse and it seems like there's a lot of layers of things that you could do in this game and so i think it's going to be very exciting very fun to play and i look forward to continuing um but I, I have to be honest, like I don't want to like just be on a hype train. Um, I will say that like for my initial expectations compared to like just jumping into the game, it does start off a little bit slow. Um, but again, I still am keeping hope alive and I'm definitely um, glad to have been able to um, check out the game prior to tomorrow's release play it you know and get this out to you guys but actually i said tomorrow but by the time you see this video it'll be the release date that's when i'm releasing this so it should be friday october 26th and you guys should be able to go pick up the game if you think this is something for you i actually recommend it i just think that if you're going to play this you definitely should clear out some space on your desk clear out some space on your console because you're going to need the space so um um, shout out to you know the GameStop in Marietta that allowed me to be able to get this game so I could be able to review it for you guys. Shout out to the homie who told me to give you guys a warning that there were spoilers coming ahead, but I'm pretty sure you guys knew there were spoilers coming ahead. This is a first look gameplay review, so I, I don't see how you thought you would see a first look gameplay playthrough and not spoil anything but um other than that yeah i'm very excited about playing this game i'm very excited about it taking forever i heard it was like uh, at least 60 hours of continuous content for just the story not side missions roaming and all the other stuff so I'm, I'm extremely excited i just hope that my workload gives me enough time to be able to you know game and get through it but i'm gonna I'm grind i'm gonna grind on this um yeah i'm excited so red dead redemption i will say my expectations would have put it at a nine and my first gameplay puts it right at about uh, i want to say a seven eight and i'm hoping by the time i actually get into the game and play it and kind of free roam that i'll be back up to that nine so right now i'll give it like a good seven seven point five and that's just based off of the limitations of what you can do it's like you can hardly move around you can't run whenever you want to you can't but like i said all this stuff is subjective and it may just be because i'm in the kind of like the intro phase of the game where they like tutorial teaching me but um from from what I see I can only speak on what I see and experience you can't run whenever you want to you can kind of like just run when it says hey now you can run um, you can't you know just be as free as I would like things to be for a game that 
is a sequel to a monster game. Red Dead Redemption was a dope game in it. And I know those fellas over at Rockstar can do a lot with games because, you know, they do Grand Theft Auto and Grand Theft Auto is a huge, a huge game. So, and this is bigger size wise. So hopefully it can be bigger fun wise as well. So that's it for me. Um, thanks for watching another video. Hope to see you guys in the next video. Until next time. Ciao. Whoa.